Hey guys, Alec Pierce, uh, Alec Pierce Scuba Tech Tips. Here we are again with a good idea. And uh, this again is another one of those tips as a result of you guys asking me some questions. We did a tech tip a while ago on how to repair a wetsuit, how to glue and repair it and so on. But somebody has called and said, listen, I got all kinds of loose threads on my wetsuit. What do I do about that? And that's a very good question because I remember that every spring, oh, by the way, I should tell you, you may notice that my uh, t-shirt is different. No, it's not red. It's a different name on it. I'm going to take a look at this name because we're standing in the service center of Aquasub Diving Center uh, here in Richmond Hill, Ontario, in Toronto, Ontario. And uh, so the owner here and the guys here are excellent, great dive center. And uh, they have offered us their dive center to, to, uh, to do a few of these tech tips. So we're going to move around a little bit. You might see some different dive stories, which I think is interesting for you. And the dive store owners certainly like it too. Anyway, just save some questions, right? So wetsuits. Yeah, I remember that every spring, we used to get some of my staff, and they would sit down and take every wetsuit off the rack, every rental wetsuit off the rack, and I would have them go through every part of that wetsuit, every seam on it, and some of the wetsuits, like this is a typical example, some wetsuits have dozens and dozens of seams, lots of them. I'm not a big fan of that, but some of the thinner suits, the three and five mil suits, have a lot of styling to them, a lot of shape to them, and that requires seams. But anyway, I would get my staff to go through every wetsuit and check for loose threads, and if they had any loose threads on them, they would repair them. I'll show you how to do that. So they would check everything, and if you probably have noticed, because wetsuits, just by their very nature, they're cloth, they stretch and pull and so on, you have probably noticed if your suit is more than a few months old, that you probably have some loose threads. It might just be a little bit sticking out, you should take care of it. It could be a long thread sticking out, you should take care of it. Sometimes, if you don't check them regularly, you'll find that the seam is actually starting to pull apart. Get it fixed right away. The seam is glued, of course, so it's quite strong, but the stitching keeps the nylon together. We talked about that in that previous uh, tech tip. So if, if, get it fixed right away. Well, how do you fix it? How do you fix the threads? They're nylon threads. You can't glue them. And if you just cut them, it doesn't help because it'll just unnotch and start pulling out again. Definitely don't pull on them. Some of these are lock threads. Some of them are not. Some of them are, are, are a, 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 a sort of a, a blanket stitch. Zip, 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 zip like this. It's not locked in there. And if you pull on it, the whole thing comes apart. So what do you do? Well, it's really very simple. You have a couple of different options. It is nylon thread. And see, that's the secret. Nylon bears, by its very nature, doesn't like heat. I don't know if it doesn't like it or not, but I know nylon melts if it gets too hot. And that's the secret to it. So if you have a thread like this one, I'm not sure if you can see that, Kevin. <clears throat> Pardon me. But if it, there's a long thread. And this, this is the, the, the stitching that holds that little bit of surge on there, that little tip. And I even yank on this, the whole sleeve, the whole end of the sleeve will come out and look like heck and, and not last very long. So we're going to get rid of that thread right there. How do you do that? There's a couple of different things you can do. Obviously heat. So if you're very, very careful, you can use a good old lighter. Yes. Um, bick your suit. Does that make sense, Kevin? You can bick your suit. But anyway, the other thing you can do, if you have a lot of seams in particular, and it may be a little bit safer, is a soldering iron. Yeah, get a, just a simple soldering iron, a little pencil type or the bigger tr trigger type, gun type. Get a soldering iron. Get it heated up, and you can direct it very, very carefully and just touch the thread exactly where it's right against the nylon suit itself. Just touch it lightly, and the thread will fall off. And if you look closely, you'll see that where it's melted, there's a little nylon ball. And that keeps this, the thread from being pulled back into the suit and getting worse. Now, keep an eye on it. It doesn't work perfectly. But let me show you what happens here. So there's a thread on there. <clears throat> I'm not, can, you, can you zoom in there at all, Kev? If you zoom in and watch that thread when I put heat to it, whoa, now you got to be careful here. See that? Whoa, look at that. And you see, I don't know, can you see that, Kev? Can you see that little ball on it? So all you have to do is get real close to the suit and just quickly go like this. Watch. It's a little slower, maybe. Oh, it's stretching now. One more time. Gone. And if you're able to look in there, you can't really, but there's a little ball in the end of that nylon thread. That nylon thread, it used to be there, and that keeps the thread from being pulled inside. So you can go over your entire suit, and anytime you find a thread that's loose and pulling a little bit, don't clip it off. You don't need to. Use a, a, a Bic lighter, any kind of lighter, or, or a soldering iron is even better. And quickly, and your suit will look like new again. All those loose threads are gone, and the suit won't start pulling apart. Okay, so there you go. There's the answer to that question. I'm sorry I don't remember which one of you folks out there asked about that. I appreciate the comments. But that's all you do. It's the simplest thing in the world. In the spring, in the fall or the springtime, when you start diving again, take your suit, 
Take five minutes, go through all the seams. It's usually the ankles and the, and the, and the, and the wrists that, that, that are, are, are an issue. And check all those threads, clip them off, and it'll make your suit last a lot longer. Just that simple. How to fix the threads on your wetsuit. Hope that was helpful. Alec Pierce Tech Tips. Talk to you again real soon.